The search for a missing swimmer off Malibu has ended in tragedy tonight. The body of the 29-year-old man was found in the water near Tower 9 at Zuma Beach. As KCAL 9's Brittany Hopper reports, the discovery followed a dramatic rescue operation. Big surf at Zuma Beach on Sunday claimed the life of a 29-year-old man. Lifeguards say four to five swimmers had to be rescued from a strong riptide. But one man didn't make it, as witnesses frantically watched the rescue happen on a busy beach day. As I was swimming, I saw that the lifeguards were pulling everybody out of the water and screaming like they were blowing their whistle. Lifeguards say everyone got out of the water, but sadly, one man was pulled out farther into the ocean away from shore and he drowned. This is cell phone video taken by a witness of the rescue. Scuba divers and a helicopter searched for the man's body for close to a half hour. The LA County Sheriff's helicopter spotted him in the surf line under the water, and then we had our jet skis, PWC rescue swimmers go over, pull him out of the water, and we started CPR. Just on Zuma Beach alone today, there have been 78 rescues. Lifeguards say with the big waves, people need to be good swimmers when going out into the water. And if you get caught in a riptide, Relax, try to conserve your energy. Outside the surf line and where the waves are breaking is where it dissipates and it stops pulling you out and just swim parallel to shore. Lifeguards say the man who drowned was here at the beach alone and they are not releasing his name until his family has been notified. At Zuma Beach, Brittany Hopper, KCAL 9 News.